Hey guys, welcome back to What's the bureau. We're gonna Carter? talk. You fit for duty? A little groggy, but I feel fine. Get me back out there and let's finish this. Good. Bring up the map. There's plenty to be done. Really? Let's let's talk to Falk first. You had us worried back there, Carter. What happened to you? The physical pain was intense, but the worst part was I couldn't think straight. Couldn't remember my own name or what the hell I was doing. Still only remember pieces of what happened. Well, it's good to see you on your feet again. I assume you're fit for duty. Absolutely. Well, actually, you know what? I'm not sure. Still getting back up to full speed. But if we'll be pressing our advantage, I'll make do. I know you will. This is a critical moment. We finally have a real fighting chance. Uh, what are the results? So we killed their leader, shut down their network, and closed their gates. What are we seeing in the field? Cleanup forces report a marked difference in enemy behaviors out in the field. Some are fleeing, some are going berserk. But most are just confused. Is it enough? One of our teams just went back to Rosemont, Georgia, and completely routed the enemy. That marks the first time we've successfully driven the outsiders from an entrenched location. And it won't be the last. Yeah, yeah. town by town. This war could take months, maybe even years. But the end is in sight. Did we recover anything? I hope the scientists got something useful from our little trip to the outsider homeworld. I don't expect us to be going back anytime soon. You mean other than the ethereal creature you captured? Dr. Weir has been analyzing how Mosaic functions. A shame it was destroyed, it would have been a useful tool. No thanks, Falk. I like to do my own thinking. Regulated by the right individuals, Mosaic could have been a boon to humanity. Imagine all peoples of the world connected. I'm yeah. sure Stalin would have agreed with you. Any leader would. Mosaic is a tool. What matters is how you use it. It's it's like the internet, guys. Everyone connected and stuff, and watching people play stu watching stupid people play games on YouTube. Cough, cough. Let's get to work. Enough talk. Let's send these bastards packing. That's what I like to hear. Okay, let's see what we've got going on. I want to see. Let's let's change our agents. I want Firebird because I haven't done much with him. Actually, you know what? I'm going to base this on the power-ups they have because I want to use the ones I haven't really done much with. You know, I have time. So you, um, we've used those definitely. That's me. Have I used a rocket turret yet? I don't think I have. Um. Huh. I'm trying to think now. Because I know I've used those. Yeah, let's go with Kyle. Let's do a rocket turret thing. Um. Maybe we will have... Oh, I haven't used the cloak yet either, so let's do that. And then we're going to go ahead and give... I think Kyle didn't have the... See, yeah, he doesn't have the plasma assault cannon. So yeah, we all have plasma weapons. And I'm going to go ahead and not use the plasma sniper. I'm going to give myself the blast... Uh, you know what, no, let's do... Uh, yeah, blaster launcher and the hit plasma assault cannon, because those are like my favorites right now. Sticky grenade, and I guess, what was the gunner pack? Oh, maybe I'll do that, laser efficiency, because it might be a little bit better than... What is this? Oh, that reduces enemy attacks and increases clip size, so that might be better. So yeah, I, I know I have, a, a, what do you call it? Kyle with a plasma assault cannon, but that's just a really fun weapon, okay? Don't judge me. <laughs> I think we're good with this. And we're gonna go to mission selection. There is some news from the front. From Pima, New Mexico, towers fall. Since first discovering the outsider construction in Pima, we have maintained a long-range monitoring station of the tower, and today it has given us our first signs of victory. The transport tower is beginning to show signs of decay and imminent collapse, whether a result of the disruption of the enemy's mosaic network or a lingering structural damage from our agents on the ground. This points to potential reclamation of these areas. Long winter in Sioux Falls, South Dakota. 
Enemy activity in America's farmland has led to significant crop shortages, and combined with the disruption of interstate and international trade tra and transport, the nation faces a shortage of food and fuel for what threatens to be the coldest winter on record, particularly in, re particularly in remote cities like Sioux Falls. If the final phases of the war are not completed soon and vital trade restored, America may face a new threat to its continuation as a global superpower. America rebuilds Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. With the first signs of success, our operatives can begin to return civilian lives back to normal. While communication remains partially jammed, major cities are no longer engaging in nuclear preparation drills to shield the public from outsider activity. With industrial centers like Pittsburgh returning to almost normal operation, we can begin to consider rebuilding the towns and villages lost to the communist sneak attack. Okay. So again, we've got a few minor operations, one big one, um, and a, what is this? Not minor, oh, dispatch, that's the word I was looking for. We have two dispatch missions. First is space junk. Uh, a laboratory in South California has been working on spacefaring uh, satellites. Director Falk wants all of their equipment and prototypes for XCOM, send agents to investigate whatever has survived the outsider attacks, and be bring back anything or anyone of use. Okay, so we're going to send in, I guess, it doesn't really matter who we send in at this point, because everyone's, you know, maxed out. Next, uh, claiming what's ours, Seattle, Washington. Before the attack, an Air Force research facility in the area was secretly experimenting with using lasers to, inter lasers to intercept missiles. Send a team to recover whatever equipment and research they have. This could help us develop weapons to fight the outsiders. Oh, cool. We get a plasma pack. And let's just send a couple guys and go for it. I think that's all the dispatch missions. So we've got one minor operation. Operation Angel. And this says... Secure sleepwalkers. The outsiders are rounding up human sleepwalkers in a hidden facility for transport back to their homeworld. Infiltrate this facility and rescue the sleepwalkers. Oh, that sounds pretty cool. Let's get started. Yay! Sky Ranger. The dense road redwood canopy makes it difficult for aerial recon to provide detailed information. As always, be careful. Each sleepwalker back brought back is another data point for the scientists trying to cure the infection. Okay. I guess that makes sense. Oh, there's a suspected Vengate. Okay. Must be nearby. I can already see the corpses. Move quick, and hopefully there won't be any more. Afford to lose. Okay, there's a letter here. Dear Carol, you're not going to believe me when I tell you this, but please try to keep an open mind. I think the park ranger assigned to the campground is some sort of alien. And yes, I know how crazy that sounds, but I went outside the cabin a couple nights ago, and I saw him, and he didn't see me, and he, his skin did this this thing. That sounds, uh, you know, encouraging. I mean, there's a massive install. There's like not a massive, but there's an installation thing right there. The roads are blocked off by trees and stuff. So let's move ahead. It's kind of nice getting back to, you know, non alien suits. But I miss my hat. I kind of wish, you know, there was like a backup hat or like a backup suit even, because, yeah. I wonder if Carter's clothing is actually changed based on what he has equipped. Like, because I'm wearing stuff similar to what... What is it? Whoever wears, like, a turtleneck? Because these guys are both wearing suits, aren't they? Whoa. I heard a noise. Oh. Is this... Take cover. On it. Okay. Don't mark target. Move behind the full cover. Way. Or not the full cover. I guess it isn't full cover. Oh well. You're an engineer again, so move forward here. Move. What are you doing? That is just a terrible spot. Can we do a fire mission, actually? Oh, what do we have? We should check that first. 
tech commander. That's going to be high priority. Take him down. Outsider, outsider, couple sleepwalkers, another outsider. So we're going to have you do a crit strike on the tech commander. Drone assist. And a fire mission on these two. Even though they're probably going to move behind Go cover as soon, so I might just want to wait on that. In the meantime, we can set up a drone and a silicoid. And maybe even mind control one of these guys. The guy in the far back. Because he'll be turret. like... What do you call it? He'll be Fly flanking, basically. Camouflage. I think... Deploy. Yeah. Mine. Behind cover. Now. Attack. And while you're invisible, move back here. Attack. And mark. I think the tech commander's dead. No, he is not. We're gonna take him down now. Take it out. And he's dead. Okay, cool. Now you can mark. Oh, there's a drone. That's your target. It's an advanced drone too. I want you both. There, there are two drones. Okay. Looks like the uh, outsider over there actually took down my mind controlled one. So that's cool, I guess. Do an artillery strike there. Yes, don't move at all. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry, I had to watch that happen. Focus on the drones. That way I can focus on the drones. Because I have to know where they are. Oh, that was not very nice. I guess they would have had it both, like, healing each other. Huh? Anything else? No, I think that's it. Alright, so I think we're just gonna head forward? Yeah. Ooh, what's that? Now, actually, I'm going to check out what's in this house, because, okay, we got some, still we have some bullets, that's kind of weird. Wait, you're shooting at someone? Oh, there's backup, okay. There's a letter, though, too. It's hard to describe, it was like he flickered. Like, one second he was Ranger Harris, and the next second he was, god, I don't know what he was, but it wasn't human. Plus, something else weird happened earlier today, and I don't know if it's connected to him or not, but I don't see how it couldn't be. Okay, so that's a continuation of the earlier letter. Let's move me down. Is this the only outsider? Because you can just crit strike him. Um. Hello? I mean, usually when combat ends, everything resets, basically. Are they just going to keep coming? Because I think they're going to keep coming. Focus on that target. We lost the drone. Okay, recon. Get behind this tree. That's what I just said. We need some rockets, Katarn. Oh, we lost the drone. No! Here, the set a rocket bomb. turret, like, right in this little hole. And I'll go ahead and pop a silicoid. Attack! It's mine! Um, otherwise... I don't know what else we can say. Uh, you can actually attack this guy. Maybe also drop a mine in a way that will hit both of these guys, because that can happen, right? Okay. Let's lift the turret. There we go. <laughs> I lifted it and it exploded. And... Oh. Oh, it's about that time again, guys. Next time on the Bureau, we're going to move ahead. So I'll see you then, guys. Take care.